like that. I don't like that at all. Oof! Jarl has appointed me to be your house, Carl. It's an honor to serve you. The Jarl has recognized you as a person of great importance in the Hold. A hero. The title of Thane is an honor. A gift for your service. Guards will know to look the other way if you tell them who you are. As my Thane, I'm sworn to your service. I'll guard you and all you own with my life. Hmm. All right then. So all I have to remember is that there is a barrel in the stables that I have stuff in. That's all I gotta remember. Still too much. Oh, I know how to make a quick buck now. I serve Jarl Balgra as steward. The Jarl has put out a bounty on some bandits. Here, take a look at this decree for details. That is an old tale, but well known to those of us who serve in the keep. Long ago, there lived a mighty hero of the Nords, Olaf One-Eye. Olaf did battle with a fearsome dragon named Numenex. The struggle between Olaf and the dragon culminated in a mighty duel atop Mount Anthor, with Olaf the victor. Olaf returned in triumph to Whiterun. By his decree, the city's keep was rebuilt as a prison for Numenex. And so, from that time until this, our great keep has been called Dragon's Reach. Hmm. Well, there are three of them. Arranged in three tiers, as you may have noticed. The Plains District is so named because it's the closest of the three to the plains that surround the city. The inn and marketplace are found there. Most of the city's residents live in the Wind District, which is the middle of the three. Dragon's Reach occupies the highest, which we call the Cloud District. From here, the Jarl can see all that goes on within his city. Ah, splendid. Our fine city has a proud history, and I'm happy to share what I know. The history of Whiterun begins with your Vasker, the Hall of the Companions. For a long time, it was the only building on the mountain. As time passed, a thriving community sprang up around your Vasker, as was common with Mead Halls. Today, Whiterun is the jewel of Skyrim. I can say without boast that it is the greatest city in all the holds. Near as I can tell, a bunch of ancient Nord hermits who live on top of a mountain. Never heard of them talking to anybody before. If they really do want to talk to you, you'd better go find out what they want. You never know. The only thing I remember is the old story of Tiber Septum being called Dragonborn by the Nords before they switch sides and join the Empire. No doubt those Greybeards up at High Rothgar will talk your ear off about it. Ooh, what's this? 
Nimm Mut. Das ist ja ein Or get sorted out. Holy crap, the huge. Good God. I think he's enormous. I, I immediately get stuck. This is how like math and stuff. How do you feel?
Stay safe.
That was amazing. That was amazing. Wow. Apprehensive. Let's see we do this. Okay, there we go. Trial and error, my friends. Trial and error. Are you feeling sick? I don't know much. Only the old tales about the ancient heroes who would use the voice to defeat the enemies of Skyrim. I just said that. They say the emperors used to be dragonborn. But that all ended when Martin died during the Oblivion Crisis. The Greybeards can tell you much more than I can. They're the masters of the way of the voice and taught Tiber Septim himself. Well, I only know what I've heard in the old tales. Shouting is an ancient form of magic, the use of one's voice to project their power. If you can shout, you need to go see the Greybeards. They'll know what to do. You know, if you've got the aptitude, More so than normal. you should join the mage. Something really should be done. Yes, yes, take care of it, Proventus. Whatever it is you're talking about. I serve Jarl Balgrim as steward. Excellent. You've done us a great service. Here is your reward. Hey. Enjoy your visit to Dragon. Okay, so we killed the dragon This was a somewhat even thought said. Quite the even thought said. But yeah, I'm just gonna leave it here for today. Maybe we're going long enough. I've been recording for like three hours. <laughs> oh, I fell in the water. 
And yeah, I'm, like I said, I'm gonna leave it here. We do have like the Minecraft coming soon too. You know, Clarinet is soon going to be making a return. He says as he keeps falling in the water. But uh, <laughs> yeah. So thanks for watching, and I will see all of you in the next wonderful video. Wait, 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 wait. my stuff like this. There we go. So yeah, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next wonderful video. Bye-bye! Whoa, whoa, put that away, put that away, put that away.